everyone welcome to my channel and it's me again today i'm so excited to talk about new releases what is a sneak peek what i will be interested on it maybe buy it maybe not and uh just very quickly what i used to create this look i use a pat mcgrath this small quad uh this is older quad it's from celestial or this lux quad deep space divinity and this is how the uh, quad the look i really really enjoy this color which is really kind of with a bluish undertone and i really love this matte and normally matte is not really blown me away but this matte is something so this is the quad and also to enhance my look you know me i just can't go just simple i use these two products which i really absolutely adore from color pop this um super shock shadow i think this is a super shock shadow and it's called ice dream i'm going to swatch it too look at this beautiful color with a blue pinkish reflection so it's really good very good to go with this color so i just put a little bit of this everywhere and i really did even a highlighter with this beautiful color so if you can see when the lights hit and to enhance even more i use this a liquid shadow from Moira and this color is 08 Regal. So this is a really beautiful liquid also reflected with blue, with pink, with purple. And I put it over here to really enhance even more. That's what I use for my eye. I hope you like it. I'm going to put also the shorts how I create this look. So you're more than welcome to watch. I will put it in my description box so you can simply go and check it out my shorts. Also, for, to create the sleeve, I use from Pat McGrath Linen, it's called Blood Lust. And then I went from Charlotte Tilbury, um, gorgeous, gorgeous lipstick, it's called Electric Pop. Look at this lipstick, amazing, smells amazing as well. And on top, I put a little bit of, from Pat McGrath, a lip gloss, it's called uh, Pale, Pale Fire and Nectar. This is actually the last purchase I did at Sephora sale. I think it's so vibrant and so gorgeous. If you agree, let me know. Uh, yeah. Let me talk about myself a little bit and let you know what is my channel about in case if you just by accident click first time and you don't know anything about me. So first of all, my name is Angelique. I'm also a dance instructor who loves to dance and teach. And my channels have a lot of aspects. Most, uh, most of the things I would say I accent on makeup because is there is more stuff going on, more palette released. But again, I don't buy all releases, all palettes. I only buy what is really attractive to me. And right now I have so, so many palettes, which is really even more limited to me to see what I have in my collection and really purchase what I really going to use it. The last things what I purchased, it was Glam Light, the Fresh Prince collection. I only purchased the highlighter and the palette. I would say I like it, but I'm not blown away. So to say that I create so many different looks using different palettes, give you a full opinion about palettes, reviews, so on, so on. Also what I do in my channel, it's traveling. I travel five star hotel or villa with my family, or, of course, or apartment. And I do review about this destination. If it's not a all inclusive hotel, I will show you the restaurants I go, I rate them and so on. The other aspect what I do is hairstyle. And I'm so, so happy to include this aspect in my uh, channel because I do it with my daughter. And this is what make us kind of bond together. She's 12 and a half years old. So we create so many gorgeous creation hairstyle with her. So you're welcome to check it out. You're welcome to check it out the full tutorial, which is includes more details. And also we have a short, which is literally take you one minute to check it out. And the our last things, not the last things, uh, two more things. So another thing what I do is rating restaurant here in Toronto or wherever, wherever I travel and every uh, uh, rating of restaurants you can find in my shorts. And the last things I do is a skincare. I love to do skincare. Most of my uh, skincare products is Korean brand. Why I love them? Because first of all, they're affordable. Second of all, they have a very beautiful new technology, which is really go so fast i can't even catch with them and there are so many many brands with a powerful powerful ingredient in other brands as well but the more the more i use 
I'm I leaning to Korean brands because, as I said, affordable and such a gorgeous ingredients. And my evidence is my skin right now, the condition of my skin. It's really, really improved. Uh, I can talk about that for a long time, but I'm not going to concentrate over here. You can uh, easily check out some video, my latest video about the unpacking new Korean products with some new technology. And uh, my skin, by the way, dry combined skin. So more than welcome to see how I improve my skin. And today, finally, I introduce myself. Uh, let's start to talk about new releases. What excited, can't wait to share with you. And looking forward to see you. Hi, okay, I'm going to sit on the side so I can display the picture what I'm going to talk about and the first things what catch my eye and actually make me so excited maybe even I'm going to try it it's house lab releasing new color fuse longwear hydrating glossy lip cheek blush balm stick so you can use it other blush and other uh, lip balm so it's a serum base high pigment blush with more than 70% skin care which will hydrate your skin make skin look plumber all in long wearing uh, glossy balm and what is ingredient uh, first of all it's cause arnica using your your redness or bruises like when you have some you know treatment done you need to use arnica so it said reduce redness and irritation uh, goji berry complex boost radiance and make skin look plumber and the last ingredients is fermented shiuko promotes collagen and antioxidant uh, protection also this product is vegan gluten free and cruelty free and blah 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 it's cost 34 american dollars each and it's available now at sephora and let's give you a link. I will try to find the link if you're interested. Okay, let's talk about the color. Color is all Miami color, the one I like. So we have a beautiful pink. We have um, even like a purplish one. We have orange, whoever loves orange. Whatever you want, you can choose from this color. And if you have a deep, darker skin, they have a deep, darker color. But from this list, I would say uh my preference will be some pink or orange even it's nice i want to check it out at sephora play with it see how it is but it's promised us a uh, pigmentation i like when it's actually pigment spectrum cosmetics i heard about this brand but I never tried it they're releasing a midnight moss collection a beautiful collection uh it's a little bit dark for me but some shades are very appealing because they're very shifty i think they're special shade which is really attractive and also they have a, a separate uh, bundle which is a uh, launching also uh, already launched and it says more special shades over there which is absolutely gorgeous as well not interested to try right now new brand because it's already so uh so many brands releasing so many stuff so i think i'm going to stick for now with brands i know and i really know about them so i think i make my life easier okay this is interesting release holika holika and as you know i love korean brand and holika holika is one of korean brand they're releasing new tinted milk cream blush color and they have eight colors uh they displayed and they are very very like uh, pastel looking colors i don't know maybe they are cool they look they look gorgeous so maybe if i see somewhere i probably will purchase one of them because as i told you i like holika holika it's one of my uh favorite brand and it's not like a high brand i actually from holika holika my favorite things is bb cream which i always talk about it and it has spf 45 so that's why i'm familiar with holika a lot nars releasing hydrating primer so what it's promise are it's a lightweight primer enhanced with a natural glow for 12 hour and smooth and seamless makeup wear wear it's a natural glow which is which is also great so it's not glow glow it's not matte it's like i would say it's like a satin 
uh, and it's 93% skincare ingredients. I actually like that now days a lot of brands start to put a lot of skincare products inside because a lot of people believe that um, makeup is harming your uh, skin but right now you can't really say that because a lot of products has actually a beautiful ingredients actually to not only prevent uh, you know from sun damage or uh, you know from aging they actually have a powerful ingredients which is actually enhance your skin and getting and making it better so if somebody telling you oh makeup is bad for your skin I think you have a great proof that is really not a bad thing to put makeup because it has a lot of powerful ingredients. It's actually have, uh, let's talk about this guy, the primer, double hyaluronic acid features, two sides of molecules, uh, which is immediately hydrate in surface and deliver deeper moisture. So you see, we have a lot, a lot of stuff inside so it's cost 42 dollars and it's available now at sephora i love primers but i have enough primers right now nars also release makeup setting mist and it's skin enhancer mist that sets hydrate and protect what is protect from <laughs> oh so it's protect you from blue lights and pollution that's basically what it is also 98 percent ingredients last long and look better locks in hydration 24 hours locked makeup for 12 hours and non non kiki true color wear without smudging blah 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 cost 36 american dollars is available right now and it's 90 mil pat mcgrath i already saw her preview but it wasn't um available yet and now i think it is it's already available, I think. So she's releasing, and a lot of brands now, I think, start releasing Creon, look like a Creon. It's called Dramatic Mega Lip Pencil. So it's a pencil, but it's a lipstick. I don't know what kind of formula it is. It's said comfortable texture. Oh, it's a matte finish. It's a matte finish. Precious tip, easy to use pencil, uh, vegan free, cruelty free and they have so many colors 12 colors what i like about this that it's they have a colorful uh, and nude color so everybody can choose uh for themselves because i'm not really a nude person i don't really like nude colors sometimes like a rosy leaning but for me i prefer a bright colors and here we go we have everything and the price is not bad it's 29 uh, american dollars and you can use code MEGA10 and check out and get 10% off, which is actually great. Not a bad price at all. Okay, uh, this release I already heard and I already see some YouTubers um, did a, a full tutorial review about this palette. And I'm talking about Lito. cosmetics and uh, they have four palettes. Uh, and all of this palette is about avatar and whoever loves avatar and anything to do with that i think uh there's a lot of fans i think it's a great release for you guys but element palette we have fire palette water palette earth palette and air palette all of this palette why it's set with a slash i have no idea it said 32 or 29 um, euro and it's a big collection. It has eyeliner sets. It has white lotus highlighter. It has team azul lipstick. And we have also a glitter gel, makeup bag, and a sponge. Cabbage is a sponge. I saw some of them except a lipstick. I, the people who did a review, they did before releasing. And there was all of them was missing a lipstick. They are saying it's a good quality so if you're thinking about to purchase this palette i heard a great review about this palette so i think it's worth it for you to purchase if you're really into this brand and you're looking forward for this particular color story elf cosmetic elf cosmetic release uh lockdown eye look with a new look it down eyeshadow primer so i think it was before Mm, 
another primer so they compare older formula primer and newest one and the newest one is uh, more in like on a tube it's a smooth creamy eyeshadow primer for long lasting wear I really want to buy that because I am run out of primer and I'm looking for a good primer I think maybe this can be a good so it's that non non chunky formula sheer who works well on all skin tones seven dollars and I think it's releasing first in Europe and then it's coming here we will see we will see I have to see it how it is and maybe somebody will do review so I'm looking forward to check that out sinful echoes release a new palette never heard about this brand it's called lotus bloom uh it's a nice color story we have some purple some blue a little bit of blue uh, a lot of actually darker color and leaning to neutral so it's kind of i would say half 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 purple bluish like colder tones and the warmer stones it's two special colors uh with the new neutral tones and another one is more like a darker shade actually i don't mind this color story it's interesting but i'm not interested to purchase anything right now it doesn't say how much is it but i know it's it's released already again elf elf released a new soft glam satin foundation drops i uh, drops tomorrow okay soft glam satin foundation interesting how much is it it's only eight american dollars and it's available in 36 shades the problem is how to find your shade that's the actually a big question so what do we have? It's a medium buildable coverage, a long lasting wear, breathable formula, uh, targets dryness, okay, with 1% hydrating hibiscus complexion and is available, as I said, on 36 sheets. It's good because I have a dry skin, so it will be actually suitable for me. I have to check it out. This is, sounds interesting and very affordable. Okay, another release, Natasha Denona is releasing a new collection and it's called golden collection okay natasha denona i don't know what's happening with most of the brand what is this gold i mean i i guess maybe neutral people will like it but for me this palette doesn't do anything it's like a blow honestly i think the other previous palette um it was much better the one was with the yellow shades uh actually very fame the popular one what i heard but this one honestly I don't know maybe the and and then she has a three highlighters and then it's gloss I don't know I don't know this is not my cup of tea at all maybe you guys who are very neutral very minimum who likes makeup no makeup this is I think it's suitable but for me no way it's not suitable for me uh, and it's palette called 69 american dollars highlighter trick was 55 my goodness it's almost like a palette and uh gloss cost 29 american dollars by surprise i started to check in canada sephora and there was no product related to natasha denona so i'm going to put natasha denona link or another link look healthy store official and when i look at this palette it reminds me ansley ray cosmetic uh the fairy girl it really reminds me of the of the uh, Ansley Ray, and they're showing the swatches. They have a special shade I can see. Uh, doesn't say how much is it, but it's released. It's not bad actually, but honestly, I was thinking it's Ansley Ray. I was getting excited, but it's not. Okay, Morphe blushes released. Uh, drip glass glazed high shine lip gloss. Also, it says vitamin E. Uh, it's semi sheer buildable non sticky available in two finishes it glaze lip and glass effect or naturally shimmer shine so they have two different kind semi sheer buildable coverage and glass effect uh, which is more natural natural shimmering finish and uh, we see some shades over here it's look nice i don't know we have to see it okay clarins clarins releasing two actually products the first products very important right now because we're coming to the summer actually we are in the summer oh my god we're already in the summer it's dry touch facial sunscreen spectrum spf 50 and i like clarins 
a bit pricey, but a good product. Actually, it's uh, uh, 40 American dollars, and I don't know how many mil it's here, but I think, I think probably 30 mil. So it's SPF 50. So it's a filter out with UVA and UVB rays, white moisturing and soothing skin, plant tree, bamboo, pear, senna, and olive tree extract. So a lot of things, organic aloe vera, blah, 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 vitamin E. It doesn't say it, um, is it like, how it is, is it, I, I hope it's not like stain white. I think it doesn't have a cost. So it's also 64% or organic ingredients. It has some scents, it's called, uh, it has aromatic formula, includes an exotic blend of tangerine, orange, uh, black currant, peon, and sandalwood. Perfect for any and every Sunday. I like actually stuff with scents. I'm one who loves it. And it's natural, so if by any chance you have you don't like a preference with a scent, this is has a scent but with natural ingredients. Another SPF, it's a body lotion spray. And also the same thing, 50 SPF, also the same UVA, UVB rays. What is different? The same thing, it's the same, same thing, just different, it's for uh, body. And the other one is just for face. Actually, that is a great, it's 42 American dollars. I love Clarins. So, and it show as a white, so it's like a lotion. It's a body lotion spray, so it's spray white. I don't know, I have to make sure that when you spray white, you, it's really a work like a cream and absorb very quickly and don't give you any residues. I think it's a good, I think it's it's good enough because Clarins normally have a good ingredients and good quality. So I don't think it will give you any residue. Let's talk about another, maybe two more releases and we're coming to the end of new releases being released, sneak peeked. Um, and uh, as I told you, I bought the new releases, actually I'm going to mention from Glam Light Fresh Print Collection and you more than welcome to check it out my tutorial. I talk about what I think, I create two looks, I did swatches, so you're more than welcome. I have a pre-order right now, but this is not my color story. If I go, I will go for Citrus Punch or something like that, or Aurora Light. That was the previous collection. I think even Citrus Punch is... <laughs> It's more attracted to me because it has a lot of orange and yellow. This, I like these colors. And it's, they have one row in the middle, all special shimmers and shades. Actually, looking forward for this brand. Maybe one day if I see something colorful, very colorful, maybe I will decide to buy. But this is what it is for now. So it's available for pre-order. Another Makeup Forever. Releasing another one. What is this? I saw this palette already. HD Skin Face essential palette a luxe edition 40th anniversary limited drop oh okay so this is a limited drop edition and it has a interesting cover um different than a regular one with the some i don't know what it's called even like a diamonds i think yes i think it's a diamond because it's a 40th anniversary they doing this 12 complementary shades what is this to accomplish? This palette features six cream foundation for blush and two new shimmers highlight shades all with an ultra natural finish. This easy to use shades, uh, sweat proof, waterproof, smuggle proof. So that's what it is. Does I don't see how much is that, but it's available. Makeup forever during the waitlist. Oh, and you have to join the waitlist because it's a special edition. So not interested in this, but something interesting because I think it's a special. And this is something uh, exciting. So here the beauty are releasing on uh, i don't know depends when i'm releasing this um, video but it's in june 7 she's going to release a new creamy delicious slightly glowy blush filter so what is this it's a liquid blush melts into the skin uh, blurs blads and builds in second contain finally a uh, mild pearl for the most stunning glow doesn't, doesn't budge once dry down available in five sheets for all skin tones can be worn solo or applied over makeup even after powder uh, smells amazing something different i like that it has a pearl inside as you know uh, my favorite one of my favorite brand is uh, Guerlain, and they use a pearl inside so i'm looking forward because this is something really interesting i never heard anything like that so far but if it's going to be good i'm sure another brands will start to do the same thing 
And the last things what I'm going to talk about, uh, it's going to be new release from Unearth Unearthly uh, Cosmetic, which is one of my favorite also brand. I haven't bought for a while anything from them. And it's going to be a new palette, which is gorgeous. I'm loving it. I don't know, so intimidating now. 12 sizzling shades, it's about the palette. And we have there four shimmers and eight ball mattes. This fully magical palette is perfect for creating looks uh, that are sure to tone up the heat. So also, Tempt Collection also features four stunning marble glowing bronzer. Oh, this is bronzer, oh, so cool. This is what I will definitely will purchase if I'm going to go for that collection. And they show these beautiful shades. So, and the each shade is for, um, depends of your tone of your skin. So we have bright pastel banana, summery gold rot yellow, fairy hot orange, heated to, oh my goodness. Anyway, so the palette is 46 uh, American dollars and the bronzer is 16 each. And is going to be released in end of the June, June 27. Uh, very excited, looking forward to see more maybe somebody will do tutorial who has a you know pr list so looking forward and i think that's it what is was excited for me so i choose what i really want to show you i'm sure it's not everything in new releases but some of them are find out something excited and i hope you enjoy and i'm looking forward uh, to see you soon for my new creation, makeup, skincare, traveling, hairstyle, anything. So see you soon. Please don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And don't forget, there's so many aspects, including in my channel. See you. Пока-пока. Bye-bye. Have a wonderful and beautiful day. Depends where you are. Bye.